few road problems and traffic jams couldn't stop people from still heading out to the mountains today. KCAL 9's Brittany Hopper has more on the allure of fresh snow. Our local mountains got dumped on, and that means heavy traffic. And for so many folks we talked to, they said that it's even heavier this time of year than years past because of the stay at home order. They're saying they want to just get out and something safe to do. Traffic backed up for miles heading into Big Bear. Usually this time of year, we see the traffic starting in running springs. But this year is like never before. We're in the middle of a worldwide pandemic and stay at home order. Yeah, I think we all wanted to get out and uh, experience something different than staying inside the house. It's getting pretty busy right now. It was hoping to be uh, get there sooner, but. <laughs> it's been a warm December, and this is the first big storm we've seen this season, dumping snow on our local mountains, but also causing havoc for drivers, taking many people by surprise. This was the scene last night over at Mount Baldy. Cars stuck bumper to bumper as they got caught up in the snowstorm. Our chopper was overhead today at Mount Baldy and cars were still stuck. For the Pearson family, they've been stuck in traffic for hours on their way to Big Bear. Typically this time of year, they're visiting family in Tahoe, but because of COVID, they stayed home for the holidays. But as soon as they saw the snow came down, they came up. However, they did not think so many others had the same idea. We uh, got in the car and it said it'd be two and a half hours. And by the time we got to the bottom of the hill, it had already been two and a half hours. And then coming up the hill, we just found the first place that we could pull over with snow because the kids really just want to play. But it still says we're going to be another hour and a half to get into Big Bear. And that will make it so we have maybe an hour to go to the sled park that we were planning on going to before it closes. Now, if you do plan to come to the local mountains and see some snow, well, the CHP is reminding folks to make sure you have chains in your car. In Running Springs, I'm Brittany Hopper, KCAL 9 News. You really will need those chains. Yeah, for sure. I'd be one of those people stuck as well. Oh, no. I, yeah, <laughs> yeah I, you got to remember those. Yeah. And, you know, tons of people headed to Mountain High Ski Resort today after several inches of fresh snow blanketed the ground after the storm. Some cars waited for hours on local freeways to get a chance to visit the resort. A store owner told us, quote, everybody from everywhere showed up today. Ah, oh, so cool. Do you ski or snowboard, Leslie? 